Bergheim have just released actually two big updates. Number one update from Bergheim, we've got the announcement of the 20 year anniversary of Bergheim happening on the 13th of December, 20th anniversary. So far, no lineup has been announced. We don't know who's playing just yet, but it's going to be happening on the 13th of December, um, which is kind of wild because it means there's going to have a jam packed December. There's going to be a 20th anniversary of Bergheim. Then a few weeks later, a couple weeks later, will be their regular New Year's Day event happening as well. So it's going to be jam packed. Um, I'm not sure how many hours it's going to go on for, whether it's going to be Friday until Tuesday, Friday until Monday. But because I went to, I think the last anniversary I went to was the 18th anniversary. So I'm going to try to go to this one, the 20th, especially with this far in advance. And, you know, God bless, God bless Bergheim for doing this so far in advance as well. Like you have to give these guys credit too. I know I suck off Bergheim a lot, but give these guys credit for the big place that they run. They do such a good job for like international, they do such a good thing for like international tourists or techno tourists like myself and others where they announce dates and stuff far in advance so that you can start making your plans, put in your holiday request, you know, arrange your fucking working from home shit and do what needs to be done to get out there. Like I really don't take that for granted because other people don't do it like other regular clubs here in London don't even put out fucking you know set lists and shit it's fucking annoying so the fact that they go out of their way to put out lineups and let you know ahead of time of dates is so fucking good so you can plan so i'm really fucking looking forward to that 20th anniversary 30th of december coming at you soon and then of course they've also released or also announced the october lineup the october lineup from Bergen has always been put out there as well so i'm really eager to come and check that over with you guys um opening Bergen on october you have a night called Revolting featuring Francesco Farmore um, and Balkama, who I'm a big fan of. The rest I don't really know too well. Carrying on, you've got a Soul Night happening there as well. I don't really know the artists on that one too well. And then we've got the main club night here happening on the 5th of the October. You've got Dax J. Dax J has been killing it lately, by the way. I was not really too good or fond of Dax J recently. I thought he kind of lost his way and it felt like he was going the business techno route. But credit to Dax J, he's kind of steered the ship back again and he's sounding harder than ever, honestly. That set he released, they released recently where he goes back to back. I forgot the other DJs he's with, but I've listened to quite a bit of it and he fucking killed it. I think it was at the Stone Techno Music Festival. It's available on that art channel. So if you haven't checked it, please do check it out. He fucking kills it. Um, Dax J is really back on really good form. So I'd be more than happy to go and see him play nowadays. Um, Jacko Jacko, I'm a big fan of. Um, Orgazan who are live Quelza. Oh, this is gonna. This might be the best night I think so far. I've just seen it so far now, but just off the bat, this might be the best one. Quelza, Orgazan, um, Jacko, Jacko, Dax J, absolutely banging Bergheim lineup already. Then in Panama Bar, you've got Sinfi playing one of the best house DJs on the scene. Um, you got Lakuti, who I'm a big fan of as well. Another great house DJ, Nick Hopner um who else is here that i know that's about it really i don't really show who stacy hot wax howl is but i love the name you got weirdos night happening as well that's good to see there you got jackie body happening as well with honey dijon again then the following club night you've got drum cell who i'm a big fan of lol snake pick up her she's playing again that's great to see rolando truncate yonti who's another great house dj mostly house i'm surprised he's playing in main river but that's so cool you got good oh ho, ho, look at that october you've got such a good lineup back to back you got good jansen hiroki sorry hiroku yamamura um roy pires who i love soundstream who i love production wise tamo Suma, who i love as well that's such a good that's a really good lineup for the 12th oh so many good people here playing um who else you've got here you've got limousine dream happy night happening i like this lineup as well Mike Servetio, Genie on Earth. Um, this is really good. But the main club night on the 19th. Who do you have here? Darwin, DJ Maria, who's fucking amazing. Um, F the mean. By the way, DJ Maria might have to be the DJ of the year for me. I'm not going to lie. On the sly one, if we had to vote again, I've been really impressed with her set. So I'm a big fan of DJ Maria. Undercover, if, we, if that was possible again. I wish they would re reintroduce their fucking DJ polls, all right. But anyway, we continue. You got N Bakumeka happening again, who I'm a big fan of, as you guys know. System Olympia. Um, who else is playing here? You got Laundret Night happening as well. With another, and Roy Perez is playing at Bergheim twice in one month. Great to see. Then you've got a night here on the 26th that features DVS1. Oh, man, have to see him again. So good. Grace Dahl, Fidel, 
Um, who else is playing here? Fadi Mohamed, of course. Pano Barroom. You've got Justin Strauss. Pan Paramida. Robert Owens. Oh, Robert Owens. Long time no see. Steffi playing as well. Great to see. And then the rest is what it is. So, obviously, the standouts for the heads, for the techno tourists out there, will definitely be the fifth. And I think the 12th. Those are the two standout nights. And obviously, if you're a fan of the other sort of like Nights on a Friday, label wise, you're going to be on them ones. But I feel like the main standout ones have to be the 12th and the 5th. Those are two fucking good um, October lineups there from Bergheim. And once again, no surprise. No surprise. So I'm going to be trying to get out there again. Going to try and get out there again as per usual. So big up Bergheim for putting that out. Appreciate them as per usual. What fucking bosses? What fucking bosses?